Hey guys, welcome to your love reading for Leo. This is going to be for your May 2024. You can apply this to your sun, moon, rising, Venus signs. We are going to take a look and see what is going on with you guys in love and the person that you are connecting with. And then we will take a look at your person to see uh, what their true feelings and intentions are towards you. And then we'll finish off the read to see what else you guys need to know, what that's for, work on, apply this to your own unique situation. You may switch the roles if you want. Keep in mind that these are general messages. Take what resonates and leave the rest behind. If this message didn't resonate with you, you may take a look at your other placements. Keep in mind that these are collective messages for the collective Leo people, not tapping into one specific person's energies in particular. If you're looking for a reading that's tailored specifically to your unique situations and your energies, I suggest you to uh, book a personal reading with me. The link for that is in the description box below. Like, share, comment, subscribe. Hit the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post and when I go live. Also, if you guys are interested in following me on TikTok, Instagram, my other YouTube channel that's dedicated solely to my travels, the links for those are in the description box below. Support me on there too. So tell me about Leo. What is going on with Leo and love? Tell me about Leo and love and the person that they are connecting with for May 2024, Sun, Moon, Rising, and signs for uh, Leo. All right, let's see what we have here for you guys. We have the Emperor here and the Seven of Pentacles. I mean, when it comes to love, you could be in this period of reassessing everything here, Leo. Leo ener uh, Aries energy with the em Emperor. We have the Seven of Pentacles. We have the World card here and the Knight of Pentacles. Could be a situation that you are slowly, slowly walking away from something here that you feel like you're wasting your time here with the Hermit here and the Eight of Pentacles. So right now, I feel like you're in this energy of working yourself, doing some soul searching here, self-reflecting, introspecting, focusing on your Pentacles, focusing on your work, focusing on your business here, whatever you guys do. All right, tell me about the Eight of Pentacles here. Eight of Pentacles, Eight of Pentacles. We have the King of Wands, Aries, Seal, Sagittarius, Energy, the Hermit. Why is the Hermit here? The Hermit and the Page of Wands. Seems like you're dealing with someone here who is incredibly immature. Like, whoever this is, I feel like this person was not really putting in any sort of effort into this relationship here. With the Knight of Pentacles here and the Magician, Gemini, Virgo. So one of the things I'm getting here is I feel like you're trying, this person is trying to make things happen here with you or that you were trying to make things happen with this person. Here's the thing. I feel like you were putting in the energy. This person's not. Now that you're leaving, this person's putting in the energy here. Uh, so I feel like there's a bit of a back and forth here. You know, I feel like somebody here has been very, very, very indecisive about you. They could have been dealing with other options here. This is a divinely guided soulmate connection. But here's the thing. I feel like this person doesn't really recognize that, okay? Or that, that this person doesn't see that right now. So I feel like that's some more, more, you know, disappointing thing about this situation here. Okay, we have the Lover's Gemini Energy, the Wheel of Fortune. Tell me the person that Leo is dealing with here. What is this person's true feelings and intentions towards Leo? What is this person's true feelings and intentions towards Leo for uh, the... Uh, for the month of May 2024, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for Leo. The Hangman and Six of Pentacles. This person's completely hung up on you here, Leo. They don't want to let you go. They're losing sleep over you here. You know, I feel like this person dreams about a happily ever after here with you. Um, yeah, this person's definitely realizing your worth or realizing that their life kind of lies with you here. Or that they belong with you. With the Tower, Aries, Scorpio energy. We have the uh, Ten of Pentacles here. We have the Ace of Swords. And the Hangman. We have the Six of Pentacles. Six of Pentacles here. And the Star card. The Nine of Swords. Why is the Nine of Swords here? And the Nine of Cups. Someone here is definitely realizing your worth here. They're, they are realizing that you are the one here, Leo. But it could be a situation that it's too late. The Ten of Cups, the High Priestess, the Tower. Why is the Tower here in the Queen of Wands? Someone here feels like they should have known better or that they should have done better here, okay? 
I do feel like this person's gonna stop at nothing to win you back here, Leo. So we have the Ten of Pentacles here and the Four of Wands. Wow. I mean, this person didn't show it, but what they want from you, they didn't show it or say it, but what they want from you, it might surprise you here, uh, Leo. Tell me more. What else does Leo need to know? What else does Leo need to know? Look out for work on when it comes to this love situation. For May 2024, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for Leo. Ace of Pentacles. The King of Cups. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces here. The Devil. Capricorn energy. Strength card. Leo energy. Three of Cups. And the Three of Swords. There will be some sort of new, new beginning here. The thing is, Leo, it could be a situation that this person can hurt you again. Six of Wands and the Three of Swords. Three of Cups and the King of Swords, Leaper, Aquarius, Gemini. There will be a, some sort of communication. There will be a reconciliation here. But like I said, I feel like someone here might get hurt again. Because I feel like someone here is really dis... You know, I feel like you... It might seem like things will work out again, but this is the type of person that might have um, the tendency to keep bringing up the past when you feel like you have resolved things from the past here. Okay? The uh, devil... The Death card, Scorpio energy. Also, in order for this to come back together here, uh, Leo, this person has to end those connections here that they've been entertaining, okay? Uh, here's the thing. I really don't see this happening from this person's end here. Because I feel like this person's going to hurt you again. The thing is, I feel like this person has done this before here. This person has a tendency to search for other people online, to talk to, to go on dates with, to hook up with. Now, you might have confronted this person and say, hey, you know, are you talking to anybody else? Are you dealing with anybody else? And I feel like this person lies about it here. You know, Leo, I feel like you might have gone as far as making fake profiles to go on these dating sites to see if your person's on there here. And I feel like some of you guys found your person on these dating sites. But here is the thing. This person is showing you that they're non-committal here, but in their heart space, this person wants a relationship. It's I kind of find it hard to believe here. You know what I mean? So that's why I feel like you might be shocked. Yeah. So Leo, I hope that this was helpful. I hope that this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Like this video, share this video, subscribe. Hit the notification bell. I'll speak to you guys in the next one. Thanks, guys. Bye.